Hi everyone, Bryce here from Dynamics. In injection moulding, there is a section in the tool between the machine's nozzle and the tool cavity called the runner system. This section houses passages which control and direct the flow of molten plastic whichever way we want it injecting in. In injection mould tooling, we do either cold runner systems or hot runner systems. Simply put, a cold runner system uses a basic passageway to connect to the product, whereas a hot runner system gets its own independent heating system and specialised heated injection points. What this ultimately means is that if your tool has a cold runner system, the plastic in that passageway will solidify every time the tool cycles. As a result, there is a small amount of wastage called a sprue and a runner. At Dynamics, this wastage gets collected and recycled back into the product with plastic regrinders and vacuum loaders. On the flip side, there's hot runner systems. These don't have wastage in every cycle because any plastic not used is kept molten in between shots. This means that you don't require post-processing to remove a sprue from the part. However, this comes at a cost. Hot runner systems are more expensive and more complex. While both options have their pros and cons, it's important to choose the best runner system according to your design needs and limitations. We can always recommend the best option for you and your product. Dynamics, where ideas are molded by experience. Thank you.